an actor prepares. Here we have the extinguished actor, Dernabil Shaban, Obladi, in his dressing room in 2011 at the Royal National Theatre, London, Great Britain, about to commence his warm-ups before going on the Olivier stage to perform the role of a Roman Emperor in Ibsen's historical play Emperor and Galilean. <laughs> So who are you? I am the Emperor. The Emperor? Yes. Constantius. Constantius? Constantius the second. My grandfather was Constantius the first. I see. Who was your father? Constantine. Constantine the Great, he was the guy, the emperor, who made the Roman Empire Christian. He made Christianity, the mainstream established religion of the empire. Do you have any brothers? Yes, there is Constantine the second my elder brother, and Constance, my younger brother. I have a sister called Constantia. As you can see, they are very constant with their naming of their children. I have a sister also called Helena. I see. And your mother? My mother was called Fausta. She was murdered, killed, by my father. Hello! Hello darling, how are you? Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Oh, you're now on video. So your mother was Fausta? Yeah. Yeah, she was killed by my dad. My father, the Emperor Constantine. Why did she do that? Well, he suspected her of having an affair with my half-brother. What was his bloody name? My God, I can't remember my half-brother's name. He was the son of Minerva, who was my father's first wife. Then he married Fausta. Um, I've got it here somewhere. Oh my God, how come I can't remember his name? My half-brother. Well, when was he killed anyway? Crispus, that's it. My half-brother, Crispus. So why did your father kill your mother? Well, apparently she was trying to seduce her stepson, my half-brother, Crispus, 
In actual fact, Crispus also was killed by my father. <laughs> so the father kills his son, and then he kills his wife. There were stories that Crispus was actually trying to usurp the crown, the emperorship, from my father, which was another reason why my brother was killed, executed. And then my mother. How do you feel about that? Well, that happened when I was fairly young. I don't know really. I don't like to think about it, to be honest. I mean, how does anyone deal with the fact that your own father killed your own mother and he was a newly born Christian? <laughs> yeah, it's a bit strange. He brought about the, the Holy Christian Roman Empire. He turned the Roman Empire towards Christ, made that the established religion. Well, I suppose, yeah. Richard Saunders, call 3438. Richard Saunders, call 3438. Thank you. I think. He killed my mum and my brother before he was a Christian. I need to check that, the dates, but I think it was before he became a Christian. So, and then after that he probably was punishing himself. And what about you? Me. When did you become emperor? Well, I, I, um, I became emperor in 337 when my father died. Well, I shared it with my two brothers, actually, Constance and Constantine II. We were joint emperors of the empire, the three of us. Um, so how old are you? Me? Well, I'm 40-something. I'm I mean, the point is, I, I died, actually. Um, when I was 44. Really? Yeah. Could anybody from IT please call zero? If anybody's here from the IT department, please call zero, thank you. When, um, yeah, I, I died in 361. Um, when were you born? I was born in 317 and I became emperor at the age of 20 um, in 337 and I, yeah I, I was running the empire for 24 years I think that's not bad considering the fact that most emperors you know are lucky to last more than two years or three years or I mean my father did well and Augustus did quite well I mean he did very well um, my successor, Emperor Julian, who uh, this play is about, actually, he only lasted two years as emperor. He was killed. So it just goes to show, doesn't it? You know, it's, it's funny. You get whole plays written about emperors who just last a couple of years, like Caligula, you know, he, he wasn't long. Um, it's, it's, what is it, you know, what's that about? Is it because they're young, you know, and they have their, their candles that burn very bright but very short. So people write films and novels and plays about these uh, hopeless cases, actually. Totally incompetent, inadequate empire, emperors. Come in!
Emperor Constantius II. That's who I am supposed to be. A Roman Emperor in the 4th century AD. O oh, blessed peace of Christ. 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 I'm a Christian. O oh, blessed peace of Christ. O oh, blessed peace of Christ. O oh, blessed peace of Christ, of Christ, of Christ, of Christ, of Christ, of Christ, of oh Christ, of Christ, of Christ, of oh blessed peace of Christ, of oh blessed peace of Christ, of oh blessed peace of Christ, O blessed peace of Christ, O blessed peace of Christ, of Christ, O blessed, 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 O blessed peace of Christ. So, as emperor, I have to look after the dynasty. I have to ensure that our dynasty survives and continues, for we are the only dynasty that can rule the empire properly, to ensure its permanence, to ensure its success, its fruitfulness, its prosperity. We are God's ordained dynasty. And as such, in order to ensure this, one has to be ruthless, cut out the bad weeds. The weeds that will destroy the dynasty. So unfortunately, I had to eliminate those members of the family which would strangle our claim to continuance of the line. Every family has rotten roots. Every, every family has rotten shoots. Every family has weeds that will grow and snuff out that which is good and pure. So, unfortunately, my grandfather Constantius married Theodora after he had married my grandmother and from Theodora's line came a bad seed and that seed needed to be strangled needed to be liquidated that seed needed to be liquidated which was my rather unpleasant task which was my rather odious task. I did not really want to do this, but I needed to destroy my cousins. I needed to destroy my uncles and aunts on the side of Theodora's line. So I had, I admit this, 11 members of their house exterminated. Like you would exterminate vermin. I had to do it. One removes cancers, and I remove this cancer from the house of Constantine. It would not have been the house of Constantine, and Constantine's house is the only house. We must remain constant as rulers of the empire. Thus, Julian and Gallus, their parents, were removed, and their cousins and their nephews, and their nieces, and their brothers, and their sisters. It was inevitable. It 
was a cleansing act. It was a medical surgery. That is all. You understand. So who are you supposed to be now? I'm dead. This is my corpse. They paint you gold when you die. When you're an emperor, that is, for your funeral. They cover you in gold leaf. And that's what's happened to me. So, I'm a corpse. I'm a dead man. Actually, it looks more like I've got the plague. It doesn't really look like I'm covered in gold, don't you think? You know, it's some kind of weird skin disease. Yeah. Is it leprosy I've got? Golden leprosy. See my feet. I am dead. I died from a fever in church. But was it really okay, fever? The lights up on the Brighton line. Lights up on the Brighton line. Thank you. Apparently, I collapsed in church. Well, yes, I did. I collapsed in church. I died from a fever. Well, that's what was said. However, I think I was murdered. I think I was murdered. Julian had me poisoned. I'm pretty sure of it. My nephew, Julian, had me poisoned. I collapsed in church, apparently. Well, I remember being in church, and I remember the pains, and it has been told that I had a fever, and it was diagnosed that I died from a fever. But I don't believe it. I'm pretty sure I was poisoned. You see, the point is, my nephew, Julian, I'd made him Caesar, but the power went to his head and he decided to become emperor. He decided to usurp my throne. So, he weighed war on me. He was marching towards Constantinople to take me. So I went to the east and gathered all my Asian armies together and marched towards him. Of course, I stopped off at church because it was a holy day and made my prayers and my rejoicings so I stopped off at the church and there I died I think that Julian sent someone to poison me it was probably yes, it. Theater, theater, lights up on one man two governors lights up on one man two governors I, I think Julian sent someone to poison me Probably in revenge for me poisoning his sister. Probably in revenge for me poisoning his wife, Helena, who happened to be my sister. Well, I had to kill her, just as I was hoping to kill him, but he got to me first. That's the way it is, you know. Can't complain, really. We were trying to kill each other, and he won, so that's, that's fate. One must accept these things. Ah, oh, yeah,
Thank you. Thank you. Got screw. Got screw. Come to the stage. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, nine, eleven, nine, eleven, 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 one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ha, 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 ho, ho, ho. Ho 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 he 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 ho 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 ha 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 ho he ha 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 ho fa 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 fa. La 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 la. La 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 la. La 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 la. La 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 fa 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 sa 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 pa 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 ka 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 Baku 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 baka 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 Swallow, 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 swallow. Apollo, 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 Apology, 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 Apology. Apology, Apollo apologizes for the rising of the sun. Apollo apologizes for the rising of the one. Apollo apologizes for the rising of the scum. Apollo apologizes for the rising of the scum. Apollo apologizes for the rising of the scum. 
Apollo apologizes for the rising of the scum. Oh, where art thou? Oh, where art thou? Peace, oh blessed peace, oh blessed peace, oh blessed peace of Christ, of Christ, of Christ. Having problems? Shall I open it? Peace of Christ. 
Oh, blessed peace of Christ. Oh, blessed peace of crime. Oh, blessed peace of crime. Oh, blessed beast of crime. Oh, blessed beast of crime. Oh, blessed beast of crime. Oh, blessed peace of crime. Oh, blessed, no blessed, no blessed. Oh, blessed beast of crime. Oh, blessed beast of crime. Oh, blessed beast. Oh, blessed beast. Oh, blessed beast of crime. Oh, blessed beast of crime. No bless or bleach of crime. No blessed, no bless or bleach. No bless or bleach of crime. No blessed, no blessed, no blessed, no blessed. No blessed, no blessed, no blessed, no blessed. Do bleed, do bless the Lord. A blessed peace of crime. A blessed. A blessed. Steps of St. Paul. A little old worm, woman, blum, blum, blum. Early each day to the steps of St. Paul's. A little old bird, woman, comes. Early each day to the steps of St. Paul's, the little old bird woman comes. In her own special way to the people she calls, come buy my bags full of crumbs. Come feed the little birds, show them you care, and you'll be glad if you do. Their young ones are lonely, their nests are so bare, all it takes is tuppence from you. Feed the birds, tuppence a bag, tuppence, tuppence, tuppence a bag. Feed the birds, that's what she cries, while overhead her birds fill the skies, all around the cathedral, the bird and the bottles look down as she sells her wares. Although you can't see them, you know they are smiling each time someone shows that he cares. Though her words are simple and few, listen, listen, she's calling to you. Feed the birds, tuppence a bag, tuppence, tuppence, tuppence a bag. Early each day to the steps of St. Paul's, the little old bird woman comes. In her own special way to the people she calls, come buy my bags full of crumbs. Come feed the little birds, show them you care, and you'll be glad if you do. The young ones are hungry, their nests are so bare, 
All it takes is tuppence from you. Feed the birds, tuppence a bag. Tuppence, tuppence, tuppence a bag. Feed the birds, that's what she cries. While overhead the birds fill the skies, all around the cathedral the saints and apostles look down as she sails her west. Although you can't see them, you know they are smiling each time someone shows that he cares. Though her words are simple and few, listen, listen, she's calling to you. Feed the birds, tuppence a bag, tuppence, tuppence, tuppence a bag. All around the cathedral the saints and apostles look down as she sells her wares. Although you can't see them, you know they are smiling each time someone shows that he cares. Her words are simple and few. Listen, listen, she's calling to you. Feed the birds, tuppence a bag. Tuppence, tuppence, tuppence a bag. On the steps, early each day to the steps of St. Paul's, a little old bird woman comes. In her own special way to the people she calls, Come buy my bags full of crumbs. Come feed the little birds, show that you care, And you'll be glad if you do. Their young ones are hungry, their nests are so bare, all it takes is tuppence from you. Fee. Fee. All it takes is tuppence from you. Feed the birds, tuppence a bag. Tuppence, tuppence. Top hands a bag, feed the birds, that's what she cries. While overhead the birds fill the skies, all around the cathedral the saints and apostles look down as she sells her wares. All, all around. Early each day to the steps of St. Paul's, the little old bad woman comes. In her own special way to the people she calls, come buy my bags full of crumbs. Come feed the little birds, show them you care, and you'll be glad if you do. The young ones are hungry, their nests are so bare. All it takes is tuppence from you. Early each day to the steps of St. Paul's, a little old bird woman comes. In her own special way to the people she calls. Come buy my bags full of crumbs. Come feed the little birds, show that you care. 
and you'll be glad if you do. Their young ones are hungry, their nests are so bare. All it takes is tuppence from you. Feed the birds, tuppence a bag. Tuppence, tuppence, tuppence a bag. Feed the birds, that's what she cries. Whilst overhead the birds fill the skies. All around the cathedrals the saints and apostles look down as she sells her wares. Although you can't see them, you know they are smiling each time someone shows that he cares. Though her words are simple and few, listen, listen, she's calling to you. Feed the birds, that's what she cries. Tuppence, tuppence, tuppence a bag. Early each day on the steps of St. Paul, a little old bird woman comes. In her own special way to the people she calls, come by my bag full of crumbs. Come feed the little birds, show them you care. And you'll be glad if you do. The young ones are lonely, their nests are so bare. All it takes is tuppence from you. Feed the birds, tuppence a bag. Tuppence, tuppence, tuppence a bag. Feed the birds, that's what she cries, while overhead her birds fill the skies. All around the cathedral, the saints and apostles look down as she sells her wares. Although you can't see them, you know they are smiling each time someone shows that he cares. Her words are simple and few. Listen, listen, she's calling to you. Feed the birds, tap and tap, tap and tap and tap and Feed the birds, tap and tap, tap and tap and. Tuppence a bag, feed the birds, tuppence a bag, tuppence, tuppence, tuppence a bag, feed the birds, tuppence a bag, tuppence, tuppence, tuppence a bag. Early each day to the steps of St. Paul, a little old bird woman comes. In her own special way to the people she calls, come by my bags full of crumbs. Come feed the little birds, show them you care, and you'll be glad if you do. Their young ones are hungry, their nests are so bare. All it takes is tuppence from you. Feed the birds, tuppence a bag. Tuppence, tuppence, tuppence a bag. Feed the birds, that's what she cries. 
while overhead the birds fill the skies all around the cathedral the saints and apostles look down as she sells her wares although you can't see them you know they are smiling each time someone shows that he cares though her words are simple and few listen listen she's calling to you feed the birds tuppence a bag tuppence 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 a bag wrong 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 i am the emperor Constantius, Constantius the second. My grandfather was Constantius the first, Constantius Chlorus. My father was Constantine, Constantine the first, the great. He was the emperor that made Christianity the established state religion of the Roman Empire. I became emperor, which I shared with my two brothers, in 337, when my father died. I became emperor in 337. I shared the rulership with my other two brothers, Constans and Constantine the First. But they quarrelled over the land that my father had given them and so went to war. Constance was killed by Constantine the first. Or was it the other way around? Constantine the second was killed by Constance. Then eventually Constance died. And so I became its sole ruler in 350. And I continued to rule the empire until 361. So in all I was emperor for 24 years. I was born in 317. My mother was Falster. Before her my father had married Minerva. They'd had one child, Crispus. However, for some reason my father believed that my brother Crispus was plotting against him and seeking to usurp the empire and so had him killed. He also apparently killed him for reason of adultery apparently. My mother Falsta was killed, executed by a husband, my father and then Crispus was killed. So, that was it. So, in addition to my other two brothers from my mother, Falster, I also had two sisters, Constantia and Helena. My grandfather. Good morning, Emperor and Galileo. Should you choose to accept it, we'll start in two minutes from now. Good morning. Maybe. My grandfather, Constantius I, not only did he marry my grandmother, Helena, but he'd also married Theodora, who gave him children. And they created a separate line of the Constance family. And to my, well, 
I decided that. But when I became emperor, I thought it was important to preserve our lion. Our lion was the best lion of the Constance family. Preserve our half of the dynasty. So I had the other children from Constantius's first marriage eliminated. No. Yeah. I had them killed. There's eleven of them that were killed. And I saved two of them. Gallus and Julian, who were my nephews. I regret it now. I regret it. I should have killed them as well. But they were hidden, taken away. But I knew where they'd gone and I could have still sent people out to kill them. But I didn't. Something stopped me. Probably Christ.